God says, Abstain from designating and eating terrestrial beings as your forebearers, for a soul father exists within the heavens. Abstain from assuming the mantle of instructor, for a singular teacher exists, the Christ. Maintain vigilance, as the exact day of your Lord's adventure is not known. Therefore, remain prepared, for the Son of Man shall appear at a time unforeseen. Observe and entreat that you may not succumb to enticement. Sheath your sword, for those who grasp it shall meet their demise by its blade. Embark on the mission to disciple all nations, baptizing them under the Trinity of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, and instructing them in compliance with my decrees. Indeed, I stand beside you eternally until the termination of this age. A moment is ripe. The dominion of God draws near. Reconsider and repose faith in the gospel. If anyone possesses attentive ears, let them lend an ear. Exercise caution in what you absorb, as the measure you employ shall likewise be employed upon you. Cultivate affection for your adversaries, perform benevolent acts unto those harboring animosity, and invoke blessings upon those who curse you. Supplicate for those who mistreat you. If one slaps you on one cheek, present the other. Should your coat be seized, do not withhold. Yield to those who solicit, and if your property is appropriated, abstain from reclamation. Treat others as you desire to be treated. Maintain the essence of salt within yourselves and foster concord among each other. Allow no entity to sever what God has unified. Permit the young children to approach me unhindered, as the dominion of God is the rightful domain of such souls. Assuredly, I declare that only those who embrace the kingdom of God with the innocence of a child shall be admitted. Venture forth, liquidate your possessions, and offer succour to the destitute to amass treasures within the heavens. Then bear the cross, and follow my path, and still unwavering faith in God. Whatever you entreat in prayer, believe it has been granted, and it shall be yours. When engaging in prayer, if any resentment lingers against another, extend forgiveness that your celestial Father may absolve your transgressions. Tender unto Caesar what is Caesar's, and unto God what belongs to God. The primary commandment resounds, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one, Love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, intellect, and strength. The subsequent decree follows. Love your neighbour as yourself. No greater precept exists. Remain vigilant so that you are not beguiled. Numerous shall arrive under my banner, asserting I am he, and they shall leave many astray. Foremost, the gospel must be disseminated among all nations, the exact moment of culmination remains undisclosed, known solely to the Father. Hence, be watchful and supplicate, for the moment remains concealed. Maintain vigilance and entreat, lest you descend into temptation. Traverse the entirety of the world, preaching the gospel to every living being. Type yes, if you believe in God. God bless you. Remain vigilant so that you are not beguiled. Numerous shall arrive under my banner, asserting I am he, and they shall leave many astray. Foremost, the gospel must be disseminated among all nations. The exact moment of culmination remains undisclosed, known solely to the Father. Hence, be watchful and supplicate, for the moment remains concealed. Maintain vigilance and entreat, lest you descend into temptation. Traverse the entirety of the world, preaching the gospel to every living being. Type yes, if you believe in God. God bless you.